to a video taping the show. I do. I do. Butt lovers. It's corn. A big lump with knobs. It has the juice. It has the juice. I can't imagine a more beautiful thing. Today we are revisiting an old classic here on this channel, watching Blank Drunk so you don't have to. Now we're really going back to our roots for this one because we started this series watching really shitty movies. I actually opened this decision up to a poll which a lot more people than usual participated on so thank you so much for that. Today we are watching Sharks of the Corn by Stephen Kang, which is just, I mean, what more needs to be said? I love it. We'll see if you say that later. <laughs> Drinking montage. It has the juice. Can't imagine a more beautiful thing. We can't pull it up the entire time. Uh oh, tums break. Haha, <laughs> tums break. Sha, sha, sha. Funny story we literally raised the roof so hard, it's collapsing. My closet roof is leaking. Subscribe so I can afford a new roof, I guess. Death is a cat's game. Cats have nine lives. Is that the name of the production company? That's a mouthful. That's a whole ass sentence. I already have so much to say. I'm such a Simon Cowell. I'm such a hater. True events. Oh, I guess I don't read the news enough. Oh, God. <laughs> That's not the real shark. That's not the real shark. This is just a little nod to what's to come. This is like a big brother picking on his little sister like, ah, and she'll be like, ah. You scared me. He's like, what? You think there's gonna be some shark in corn? Oh, that's unsettling. Unsettling. That's, that's what I was gonna say. Corn. <laughs> oh. You might want to slow down a little bit there, soldier. Are they that just drinking straight vodka? Oh, I love that. That's what you noticed. Hey, look at her lip syncing, fella. You might want to slow down a little bit there. Hmm. I've seen better lip syncing on music, ladies. Partner. I haven't had any drink in quite a while, so, uh... Keemstar is not able to hold his liquor, I guess. Keemstar is not able to hold his liquor, I guess. Oh. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I, uh... It's Beast Your Day, the sequel? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what? Not that being our first shot of it. You know what that reminds me of? That's literally that TikTok filter of Shrek in the sky. Have you seen his YouTube channel? He's got... He's got video of Bigfoot. Drop his channel name, bestie. I heard Delbert came out. Delbert? I guess he came out. Good for him. Be who you are. You had too much to drink. What do you say? Set up the panty shot. Uh, we play a little hide and seek out here. Why don't you hide your corn in my... Cornucopia. Yeah. Let's play a little friendly game of cornhole, if you know what I'm saying. Why don't you pop your corn in my popcorn bowl? Get off the stage. I wonder if there's going to be as much unnecessary nudity in this one as there was in Beaster Day. Corn, more like. Come on. Or she drunk as fuck. I got something you're going to want. Oh my oh. god, oh my god, she is going to get naked. No! Oh. I got something else for you, too. How many dresses is she wearing? I didn't realize that was a two-part thing. Drunk ass motherfucker, find that. I feel very attacked. Relax. There's a monster in here now. Wait till I get my pants down. Did he say the monster is here now? Like his wee wee is like a wrestler entering the ring. <laughs> now entering the ring. My so for those of you who don't know, that was John Cena's music that I just played. Now this is very funny music for a hot dog because his whole slogan is, you can't see me. How is that? Oh my God, it just never ends. She was wearing three dresses for what? Her wedding day is gonna be so confusing. Like say yes to the dress, more like say yes to the dresses. She's gonna be like, <laughs> okay, so which one are you gonna pick? This dress, this dress, or this dress? And she just goes, yes. I'm... Wait, when did she get naked? When we you never... set up all of the layers, it just, it doesn't make sense if she's suddenly naked. We don't know how many more layers of clothing she had under there. Get this man some colored contacts. He is not pulling off that whole like eye roll thing. <laughs> so is it just a, a killer inspired by sharks? There's no knife in his hand. The mime killer. <laughs> I'm really disappointed that there's no hmm. actual land sharks. Then or... it's eight minutes in the movie to be fair. I just don't want you to worry about me, okay? Why did they make every woman look like that? We, we put, put the, the hoe in horror. horror. Well, I didn't want it to look that rehearsed, <laughs> but I guess. Well, look at you. You're all dressed up and incognito. I thought the coronavirus was over by now. Ooh, oh, whoa. I 
didn't realize how recent this movie was. We put the corn in Corona. Fearless. Merciless. Harder, better, faster, stronger. Working, making it do, it makes us harder, better, faster, stronger. I put the shark in shark. You're gonna wear this like a crown. I like that it just turned into paper. We're being baited. Shark bait, hoo ha ha. It's my dream to be cast in something like this. Can you imagine me just making a cameo in this and then here I am reacting to it on my YouTube. Like I act like I don't know what's going on then all of a sudden I'm like, wait, who is that bitch in the back? Pause. Rewind. Zoom in. That's me. You got God. Tell me again what happened here. The last thing I remember is that Pause. Let's take a look at that shirt. I'm the bearded weirdo your parents warned you about. Either A, the actor owned that, or B, and what I hope is more likely, the casting director's like, here, wear this. <laughs> He's like, this is my type cast. This is, this is me. <laughs> this is me now. Why do they always hand me this shirt to wear? Every, <laughs> every gig I get. I thought this was going to be the one. I thought, I thought <laughs> I was finally going to break out of my typecast. I, I want to spend a little, you know, a little time with Susan, you know? Um, hmm, I see that that t-shirt is accurate. Bro, she's dead. Come on. Come in a Bigfoot. Bigfoot? Aliens? You and your brother Jonathan would like that, wouldn't you? Prediction. <laughs> but I'm thinking his brother's the serial killer. Shark boy, if you will. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm gonna call him. The reason he's gone kind of kooky is because he hasn't found the lava girl to his shark boy. <laughs> Taylor Lautner? More like Taylor Slotner. Nice, right? That was good. I thought it was that. Look for old Sasquatch. By the way, your brother, where is he? <laughs> that, oh, wait, wait, what was the train of thought? Why did you, why did you execute that line like that? That was awesome. The greatest line reading I've ever heard. By the way, your brother, where is he? <laughs> Look for old Sasquatch. Sasquatch. Your, your brother, brother where, where is he? Susan Blake was a beautiful, well-loved woman in these parts. She was a librarian, for God's sake. The words he chooses to emphasize are so funny. She was a librarian. You know what she'd probably say to you right now? Shh. Shock scarecrow. <laughs> this is not an actor. This is somebody's uncle. This just in, being an uncle and being an actor are mutually exclusive. You cannot be an uncle and also an actor. Uncle is a full-time job. Not the nun with the gun. So what's up with the shark cult thing that they've just decided to introduce out of nowhere? Why do they keep... Glitching to Stonehenge. All the cult numbers are just standing in a circle and they're like, baby shark. Do, 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 <laughs> Why are they holding up a little test tube of a baby shark? Well, this is some pro shark abortion propaganda. Uh? Pro shark abortion? Yeah. Do you see it? It's like a baby shark in the test tube. Oh. I love the multiple angles. 2009 Toyota! This is how Jeff Bezos gets his power. I knew it. I fucking knew it. Somehow a shark tank is involved. Oh yeah, Kevin O'Leary. This is some Kevin O'Leary <laughs> shark tank shit. <laughs> you thought you can only kill sea turtles with plastic <laughs> straws? Think again. Spitball, oh spitball. Oh my god. They couldn't get a 7-Eleven thick like slurpy straw. I feel myself actively losing brain cells. Hey, I have an idea. Let's lose more. <laughs> Shark bait hoo-ha-ha. -ha. That's right, 1-800-BIG-FEET for Jonathan Gottlieb. That's me. We're Green Hills Realty all the way. Why would a realty company be like, oh, we got Bigfoot here? Who, what? Sorry, I have my real estate license. Bigfoot was not one of the chapters. <laughs> Bigfoot's from the Pacific Northwest. What is he doing in Kentucky? Kentucky, more like Kentucky. Home run! We're gonna dox Bigfoot. Ten most active Bigfoot sites in the U.S. Pennsylvania. Oh, okay. <gasps> Pennsylvania, New York, Colorado, Michigan, Illinois, Florida, Ohio, Oregon, California, Washington. No Kentucky. Kentucky's not even on top 10. Actually, it says 1-800-BIG-FEET. Let's just call this really quickly as well. <laughs> B-I-G. We're very excited to tell you about a special promotion for select callers. This is about Bigfoot? Why do they hang up on us? Why do they hang up on us? How fucking rude is that? I want to know about Bigfoot. <laughs> I got the receipts. Why are you wearing that while driving? That makes you look more inconspicuous. That looks weird. No shit. Get out of the car. Get out of the 
of the car now. Cut your- Who's the paparazzi taking pictures this entire time? Got a license to these gills and I have a license to kill. Dorsal fin for these dorsal sins I've committed. I may be a shark, but at least I'm not a narc. Why don't you sit on my face, you fucking pig? I'm so attracted to you right now. You shark boy. She called him shark boy. It's canon. <laughs> I was sponsored by them. Just going on a stroll with my bestie. Why is there a dream catcher in jail? Is that not the Zodiac Killer right behind them? Am I wrong? Please, I think I'm gonna have to end it right here because I'm like falling asleep right now. Ben is notorious for quitting. <clears throat> Big ol' L for Ben. <laughs> Asshole! Well, you know what, Gottlieb? Nobody likes you in this town, let alone Mayor Zanuck or me. We don't like the fact that you came for money Right? And we had to bust our asses and make a living through the farm and run around. Carrying everybody's dirty laundry and publicizing it in your newspaper. Hell, you put stuff in there about me and my mistress. I didn't appreciate that. So much tea. The sheriff's like, hmm, well maybe I just have a vendetta against you. Because you exposed me and my mistress and not only that bitch, you come from money and you're entitled as fuck. A lot of backstory just being thrown at us monologue town style. Stop it. <laughs> There's a shark in this cornfield, dude. <laughs> there is no way I can explain the twist that just transpired, but okay, I'll try. The Jeff Bezos guy from the beginning was a CIA agent that the other cop, the blonde cop, was driving around. Right before this shark necklace reveal, she knocked out the Jeff Bezos guy. And the big reveal is that she's in cahoots with the shark cult. Like, she is also part of the shark cult. Which is weird, because the shark cult's the one that killed her sister in the beginning. <laughs> We really thought, we really thought she wanted to see this criminal be taken down. Little did we know she was a shark on the inside. Wow. I'm just doing things for everybody else and nobody giving a fuck about me. Okay, Emmy moment. Hello? I didn't believe you at first, Teddy. Teddy, more like I'm ready to avenge my sister by trusting her murderer. Lorna? I'm sorry, but you are blessed. She's a martyr. Sorry I killed your sister. Aww. And sorry she turned into a party city skull. Aww. But I did what I had to do. Make out with a dead shark. Who are you? Oh, uh, I'm one of the good guys, I, I think. One of the good guys, I think. That's so relatable because I don't know who I'm rooting for. By the power of Stonehenge. How do they choose Stonehenge? It's so random. What can we find the most stock footage of? Ah, uh, Parthenon? Nah, it's under construction. One of the other wonders? No. Oh, the Colosseum? No, that, that looks too big and grandiose. Stonehenge, it's old, it's ancient, it's, it's ruins. Just like we will ruin anybody's chance of having a normal life after they watch our movie. <laughs> Let's go. Ooh, that looks almost oh, like my hey, makeup. She, she... I feel like I'm watching Dragula. They enter the main stage and they're just like drinking freaking mop water. Does anybody know what I'm talking about? King Kong coming through. Thank God they brought it back because that was gonna that was gonna really bother me if they didn't bring Bigfoot into this shit after name dropping him multiple times. Ooh. Have him Donkey Kong his ass. You've come so hard. A what? In the end, Donkey Kong, your ass. Whoa. Finn at the end. I like that, actually. That was pretty. Leave a suggestion for what you want to see next, because honestly, I got as far as corn. That might not have been enough to base this entire video on. Thank you so much for the support. It really means a lot to me that I made it to 20,000. I have been creating on this channel for a while. Appreciate you. Have a good day. Stay safe from the sharks that lurk in the corn. Bye. Bye.